The 16th annual Give Your Heart to Autism Gala took place Thursday night at Windsor's Giovanni Caboto Club. People from all over the city paid $125 each to attend this event to help raise awareness for autism. Former Autism Ontario Presidents Izzy Faraci and Rita Michelli were in attendance. They are very thankful for all the support that Windsorites have given over the years. I think um, our group of vo uh, volunteers, our gala committee is all volunteers and, it, and it's really because they've all been touched by autism in one way or another. Many of us, uh, like Izzy and myself, we have sons with autism so um, we, we do it for our sons but also for other families that are going through the same situation as we have. We still need to advocate, we still need to educate everyone out there that, that will listen. A study conducted by the Canadian federal government back in 2014 says that autism now affects one in 68 children. Boys were almost five times more likely to be identified than autism than girls, and about 1 in 42 boys in Canada and 1 in 189 girls in Canada were identified with autism disorder. This new estimate is roughly 30% higher than the estimate for 2008 and roughly 60% higher than the estimate in 2006. Most children identified with autism were diagnosed until after four years old, even though children can be diagnosed as early as two. There's a lot of people that have volunteered for us. Yeah over the past that eventually had somebody in autism affected in their family also. So it is a, a growing concern and uh, we're just trying to help. There is currently no known cure for autism. For Mediaplex News, I'm Jonathan Hutton.